All right, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. If you were like me, you were probably up working on a very, very important project via Adobe Premiere Pro right before you updated to that 2017 version. Now, I don't recommend ever updating your program in the middle of a project. However, I know Adobe can be pushy about updating their products and you probably did just like I did and I got kind of antsy. So this is what you get. Media offline and your audio is completely jacked up and you're wondering how do you get it back and will you ever be able to get it back since you have the new version. You do not need to update to the, you do not need to go back to the old version and you do not have to link up every clip one by one by hitting link media. Speaking to Adobe Premiere Pro support, they offer a very, very quick fix. I'm going to show you how to do that right now. Okay, the first thing you want to do is exit out of all Adobe programs on your desktop or laptop, whatever it may be. Yes, that is beautiful for mine and my background. All right, and from there, you want to bring up the command on your computer. And I have a Windows computer right now, so this is how you do that. You hit the Windows key and the R button at the exact same time. And boom, there's your run key command. Let me zoom in on that for you. All right, and this is the other important part. You want to type in percent A, P, P, D, A, T, A, percent, which spells app data. And from there you hit okay. And let me zoom back out just a little bit. And then from there, you want to find your Adobe folder. And once you find it, double click on it. And from there, you want to find your common folder, which you should only have one of. I have two for the simple reason. This is how you fix it. You go to your first common folder. You don't double click it, but you right click it. And the only thing you need to do is rename it. So you click on rename and I simply put a one after mine and that's it. So you have the old common files and you have the now new common files. So with that being said, that's the fix. There's nothing more to it. So now that you have the new common file, you can exit out of that and pull up your Adobe Premiere Pro 2017 and everything should be linked up and your video should be great. You can get right back to what you were doing. All right, so good luck to you leave any comments. Um, it worked great for me, so I hope it works great for you. All right, have a good morning, good evening, or good afternoon. <laughs>